Hi Aries, welcome to your reading. This is a general love reading, it may or may not resonate with all of you. Now let's start, first let's shuffle four times. First, let's start with what happened in the past. What were the problems and the challenges? Okay, not much love into this connection or someone felt out of love or maybe was a bit dishonest and didn't want to start and continue and move this connection to the next important step. Hesitating a lot to move to the next step and not... Uh, expressing much feelings or maybe someone here the other partner was feeling not appreciated uh, very much now let's see about the current energies for aries you love them you think a lot about them even though you may know that this connection with this person was toxic unhealthy and you were very attracted uh, to them physically as well now let's see about uh, what may be affecting you in your subconscious. The fact that it was a third party story, unfortunately. So take what resonates. If it was not a third party uh, situation, I think that hurt is still there. That hurting, uh, the pain may be still there, but you are, you are recovering fast. But it was not an easy uh, ending. It was not an easy ending. Now let's see what is the overall energy for this reading. I think soon you will get more clarity and will not be focusing so much into this past person. I think uh, you will get peace of mind, uh, you will get clarity, maybe a better new connection is your way. Let's see why the Nine of Swords in the reverse. Page of Swords. Yes, a new connection, I think, is coming your way. But let's see again, how do you view the situation with this past person? You won't make things right with them. You still want to see a balance, harmony into this past connection. That's why you still think about this past person. You are at crossroads and uh, you hope that if things are right, if things... Uh, have been improved if this person has changed has improved you'd reconsider it another uh, chance even though i think uh, you are at crossroads and you still think about the past and, and your focus is to offer love to the right person you want to feel valued you want to feel loved and you want that connection to be mutual now let's see about what are their energies, their current energies towards you. I see them uh, deciding for this moment to say to stay a single. They see a big disconnection there. They they don't see that passionate connection as before, but they know that you have feelings. Uh, they still have some attraction but not uh, that deep, powerful, passionate connection as before. For now, they want to remain single. There are possible actions. Okay. If they continue in this energy, it is likely that... Uh, they will come into a conclusion that that connection does not make them or both of you very much happy long term and uh, it is because of the way it ended it was hurtful painful it was not easy at all if it was a third party situation they know that uh, it broke your heart and uh, the pain is still there mm. They think that uh, they need to come to a conclusion what to do with this past connection. And uh, at least for uh, the time frame of this reading, 
they think it is not uh, uh, smart to to make an attempt to save this connection at least for uh, this time frame because they think the pain is still there and both of you may be very unhappy about what happened I will continue now this reading in the extended with more details if you want to watch the extended you can find it now in the description box below this video see you the next reading and bye for now